<laughs> hey everyone, it's Monica, Marina, Travis. Oh, you said your real name. <laughs> Charlie. Hey Charlie, bring bring closer, bring closer. Hi Charlie. Hi baby. Hi. There's Charlie, everyone. So you didn't get to miss him this week. So it's fresh off the hook Monday with kids' lids. I hope everybody had a good week. And we had, of course, a busy weekend, so there wasn't too much time to crochet, but I managed to get a little bit of stuff done. And I was majorly working last week on a birthday present for the little boy who we went to his birthday on the weekend, Cameron. He turned one year old, and I made him a Blue's Clues hat. Now, unfortunately, I don't know how to add pictures at the end. No, wait. I do know how, but I attempted to um, upload Serve It Up Sunday that we filmed yesterday. Not working. Because my computer sucks, as you all know. Or YouTube sucks, I'm not sure. But I won't say that. <laughs> anyway. Okay, so, I have a newsboy cap with this really pretty um, variegated cotton for the summer. Loving the newsboys, Marcel. She has the pattern on one of her tutorials. Um, I said that last week, but I only said Marcel, so I want you to look up one virtuous woman, and then that way you can actually get to her channel. So, I think it might work if you type in Marcel as well, but just in case, because she's Marcel's creative crochet. So, thank you, girlfriend. I'm calling her tonight, by the way, to have a chat. She's in California, and I'm in Toronto. And I love talking to her. She's so funny. So, okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. I found, well, actually, Kevin found the scarf. Kevin is Travis, by the way. So, I made this not so skinny, but half skinny scarf. Um, and we just found it to show. So, it's so soft. This gray I bought um, at Zellers, I believe. Anyway, really, really, really nice. And I just put the fringes on the end. So, I'm thinking of putting um, pink and white flowers on it to match the hippo hat. Karen's mom. Okay, and Marina has on. You can describe it. It is a Talk louder. It's, it's a summer hat. It is blue, yellow, green, and white. And it is very, very light on your face. <laughs> good description. <laughs> very good description. Thanks. Um, I'm not sure exactly what this is. It's a um, yarmulke. <laughs> <laughs> it's, a, it's a big yarmulke. Um, Monica, as you know, has been teaching me how to crochet. She taught me single a few weeks ago, and she taught me double uh, just this past week. So she gave me the same uh, yarn, as you can see, the hat that she's wearing. It is uh, the cotton. two cotton, two shades of pink, purple, and white. And um, I just went until the ball finished. <laughs> uh, I have more, so we might add to it. Yes, it's not quite finished, but I figured I'd show what I had. Doesn't it look masculine? <laughs> and I also made a uh, miniature size. A baby washcloth. No, it's for baby. Rag. Okay, sorry. There you go. Isn't that really good? Look, he's doing so well. And I have a, um, I have a skinny scarf in the making. Um, kind of my own pattern. I've mm -hmm. done single crochet and then double crochet and then single crochet back and forth. Uh, I've had to take it apart at least three times because I'm not happy with it. But um, when it's finished... But he's doing a thumbs up like thumb. With <laughs> oh, funky old nail polish thumb. <laughs> when it's finished, you guys will all see it. See, now we're the crochet family! Told you guys! That's about <laughs> That's the kind of faces I do before it starts loading. So this is what we do while we're waiting for it to go. You ready? Go. Because <laughs> it takes forever. <laughs> anyway, I'm already crying from laughing. Dorothy, this week, has some siblings that you will see next week. Because I bought, <gasps> went to Valley Village today. Siblings? Siblings. Yes. Ah, She's brothers and siblings. sisters. Sorry. Hello. <laughs> so next week Dorothy will have some siblings Hopefully with some better lipstick than her Anyway, she's got on a slouch hat That I did in the same cotton that she was wearing the beanie hat in last week So this one is nice I think I'm going to try it with my own variation of the double crochet that I used to crochet with 
because then it'll make the stitches even longer and it'll be really nice and airy. So this, if you can, let me see if I take it off. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> it's a little tight on See, there you go. You can see that it's really airy and beautiful for the summer. So on the right size person's head, it will have the beak brim. So there you go. But anyway, I'm going to start making a bunch of these really airy ones. Um, cause you know, people who have longer hair want to keep it up in the summer or people with dreads or anything like that. And you want to keep your head cool for the summer. So did I mention the blue screws hat already? No. Okay. Yeah. So sorry, yeah. Yeah. Oh, see, I don't know what video we're on. Anyway. Okay. So yeah. So the blue screws hat was amazing. Let me tell you, did it from scratch. I just kind of, um, Googled after I started a blue screws crochet hat. Patterns popped up, not patterns, sorry, pictures popped up majorly, so I just kind of put them all together in my head and did my own kind of pattern. So I'm going to actually have to figure out how to upload from um, the computer without YouTube freaking out and crashing. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, so um, the fedora that I made, uh, Allison loved it, so I'm starting a new one, and it is flat top hat. And I'm going to do it kind of like, I don't know, just a flat top hat. There you go. <laughs> and hopefully, description. And hopefully that'll turn out maybe like a frosted snowman hat or whatever. Yeah. But again, I can't see it because it's black. I'm having this funky curve or something like that. I'm trying to see if it'll show in the camera, but probably not because it's black. So my only thing is, is because I crochet so tightly, for half double crochet, I believe that you're supposed to do two single chains going up. Streetcar. And um, I was doing two and it was giving me this sad looking bump. So I changed back to one single chain when I go to the next row. Hopefully that will help that a little bit. Okay, I wanted to show you this. Isn't that cute? Wait, can I turn it? Yeah. It's a heart. I showed the other ones, but I think I only showed pink and white, so that's a blue one. Yeah. And then I have this one in the breast, ca breast cancer cotton, which I think would look nice on white. Because see, if you put it with the variegated cotton, it kind of just gets lost. You have to put a plain color on the variegated cotton. And I have to show you... That seven. Okay, the green hat. The green hat is going to be a frog. I don't think I showed the frog hat ever. So this is the eyes that will be green around them. And then I'll do black. Um, hard to explain, but they look a little just little stars for the, the black part of the eye. And then I just um, sew in embroider basically, two little nostrils and uh, a mouth. So this is um, hopefully uh, going to be sold at some point. So, okay. Do you have the pictures on Facebook or on your website? Yes, I have there pictures on Facebook of the frog hat that I made. So, okay, this is another new blanket that I've started. In oh, can we? Can you grab one of the balls of yarn of that? Can you grab the balls of yarn of that? I think we showed that one before. Yeah, so that's the baby frog. See, there's the muff on it. So there you go, with some fluff or something. Sorry. No. It's okay. I can't. Don't worry about it. Um, it was over there. Yeah, it's right there underneath the knee yeah. yeah. So, there's the eye. See, look. So, I still like this little star thing. Isn't that cute? So, that'll be the big one, but obviously it's a different green. There's a different. Wow, what a big difference. So, this is one like uh, Hunter Green, I guess. And this is lime green. So, okay. And so, yes, I want to show the label. It's fine, I'll just show the label. So this is Bernat Cotton Tots in uh, Blueberry. I have so many different ones that call themselves Blueberry. Um, anyway, some of them, I don't know, Blueberries to me actually are purple. So I'm not really sure. <laughs> Why are they called blueberries? Squish one like that. Like squish your head. Squish your head. Ready? Squish. 
and they're purple. But anyway, <laughs> they're called blueberries for some stupid reason. So, yeah, that's the new cotton cotton yarn. Isn't that exciting? I've never seen cotton yarn. So I bought it. It was $10 for the bag of three. Um, they recommend that you use the streetcar, the four How's millimeters hooks to, um, to knit with. Anyway, so, yeah. I'm not sure how much it was for a single um, skein, and I did say last week that um, the yarn outlet that I go to, there's the actual ball of it, so it's a fair size, it's 100 grams, um, they do sell singles, but you get the deal of, um, if you buy bulk obviously, so say the one ball is $3.99, and then um, if you buy, I don't know, a bag of six, you get it for like, it would be the price of maybe four balls, it's a really, really good deal. <sighs> you know what? We're not recording again. Because this is our third try tonight. Third time's charm. I'm hungry. I want dinner. It's 5 o'clock. This probably isn't going to actually be up until 7. Because that's how long it takes. Yes, folks. For those of you who don't know how long it takes. Ask anybody who records on here. It takes forever. Okay, we're at 11.19 right now. And it cuts you off at 15 minutes. It just goes blink and cuts off. Yeah. Nick! I finished the baby blanket, the inside part anyway. Oh, it's so soft. And now I need to figure out an edging on it. The dog's barking. What else is new? He doesn't want to be in the video today anymore. Charlie, come say hi. Anyway, so yeah, next week I'll have more Dorothy heads. I want to like paint them all funky and stuff with acrylics and then maybe shellac them. That'd be so cool. Or we could shellac decoupage them. them. We can decorate them. Yes, the shellac them. them. He doesn't know what shellac is. No, I know. Stop. Moving on. <laughs> Moving on. Fine, I'll, I'll decoupage them and then hodgepodge modge them. I don't know what that stuff's called. Modge podge? Modge podge. Look at Mr. Know it all about now. See him? Not anymore. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so, um, yeah, this week I'm going to be working on some animal hacks and some orders because I got some more orders. Isn't that awesome? So Cheryl ordered two more. Um, I can't remember who ordered the new one. Right, just like yesterday. What was it? I don't know. I don't remember. I'll have to look it up. Yes, we're at twelve forty-nine. We have two minutes to make faces at you. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> Alright, so that's it. Don't forget to watch everybody else that's doing Fresh Off the Hook. This is my Fresh Off the Hook family. We are awesome! You guys are awesome. Subscribe. Right there. Comment down below. Don't forget to check out my Facebook page and my website. And I will do this again just because. That's the place where I get my yarn. So in Knit and Surge. And my website is www.kidslids.com so I will put the link down below. On Facebook, it's Kids Lids. And um, that's it. You can Google me and find me everywhere now. I haven't joined Twitter. How many of you out there have Twitter and think I should join? I'm not a tweet tweet? I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a tweeter. You'll hear that all I might be a twit, but I'm not a tweeter. <laughs> <laughs> and anybody else have anything to say? No. 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 We love you. You guys rock. Bye. Happy crochet. Happy bye. crochet. Oh yeah, I didn't say happy crochet. Charlie, you want to say bye? Want to say bye? Want to say bye? Come on. Come. No. Nice He's done. Week. Maybe. At least we'll you got see. to see him. In the beginning. Okay, bye. <laughs>